Candace Owens recently parted ways with The Daily Wire, which is Ben Shapiro's company, and I anticipated things would not remain cordial between those two, and it looks like we're getting that. Owens recently tweeted, I would like to debate Ben Shapiro on Israel and the current definition of anti-Semitism. Can somebody make that happen? Now, I didn't think much of that until I saw Ben Shapiro responded. He said, sure, Candace, I texted you on February 29th offering this very thing. Let's do it on my show this Monday at 5 p.m. at our studios in Nashville. 90 minutes live streamed. Then Candace Owens responded and said, I'm sure you can appreciate why I'd prefer to keep this off the Daily Wire platform, as well as the true reason why we were never able to make any discussion happen. Let's choose a neutral, trustworthy platform. I vote Patrick Bet David. Then Ben Shapiro responded to this and said, Candace, I can see why you'd want to hide behind a moderator particularly one who said we should rename our company The Daily Jewish Wire just yesterday. No, one-on-one, -on -one, Monday at 5 p.m. He continues, we can sit down and have a healthy debate like adults, and we'll live stream it on X and YouTube, take it or leave it. As to the true reason you didn't respond to my offer to sit down with you and discuss these issues publicly or privately back in February, I have no idea what the hell you're talking about. He then says he's signing off for Shabbat and plans to be in Nashville for this conversation on Monday. There's a lot to unpack here. I love the idea of these two debating. I vehemently disagree with both of them, but I would find it quite entertaining. Ben Shapiro is very clearly offering a venue, and we know it's legit. I can sympathize with Candace Owens not wanting to do it on the Daily Wire, considering they did just let her go. But Patrick Bet David is very much not a neutral platform. I agree with Ben Shapiro that it was pretty anti-Semitic when he said that Daily Wire should rename themselves to the Daily Jewish Wire. Shapiro is also a grown-up. He is very much capable of going on a non-neutral platform. Frankly, I don't care what platform they use. I just want it to happen.